we're gonna go ahead and do the vitamins or supplements part. All of these are Indian brands because I got these ones when I went to India earlier this year. And yeah, I just tried them out. So there's only three things here. So the first one is this. All right. I got introduced with this because before I went to India, I usually go to this uh, waxing threading salon and the lady that does my waxing usually uh, told me to try this out because before I have a lot of breakouts and then she said that when she was younger, her parents used to, you know, make her drink this like one teaspoon every morning and that it uh, cleanses the blood i guess uh, my only problem with this one is it has this effect in my body that makes my stomach hurt i guess <laughs> i guess that's probably cleansing <laughs> my circulation but yeah i i noticed too that when i do drink it like within the five days i have more breakouts but i don't know if it's just a coincidence but i did finish like this whole bottle in a month because i drank it once in the morning and once at night it's just like one small a uh, teaspoon and yes and you can even see this so um i'm not gonna be repurchasing this anymore because um i just I, ju I just don't feel like it but definitely maybe you can try this out if you're experiencing breakouts and if you're looking into like an ayurvedic route not very familiar with this uh brand though but yeah it looks like it's um you know um made out of natural herbs all right so that's that all right uh, okay it's the himalaya misha shringi <laughs> metabolic wellness so this has 60 tablets and i really like this though i don't know if it really did work or i just felt that it worked but i did like this one i'm gonna go ahead and repurchase this but even if i did want to i looked online here in the u.s and i guess they have a different formulation and i don't really like to buy a different formulation so i don't really know how i can get this one because i like this one i don't want to try you know a different one i'm gonna get this whenever i'm back in india i guess and then the next one is this so it's the ham hamdard joshina herbal cough and cold remedy so when i got back from india and dubai after one week i got a little bit ill and under the weather i got cough and all so and also it wasn't that serious compared to my family member i just had two doses of this and then the rest were finished by my family member i guess it works it's nice to have like a cough and cold remedy that's herbal probably i'll repurchase this again when i'm back in india because i haven't really seen this one in the u.s or in my local indian grocery store all right one second oh no All right, guys, so those were my supplements, vitamins part. Now let's go into the beauty parts. Oh my god, this video is too long now. <laughs> Anyways, bear with me. We're almost there. We're at the last stretch. Okay, so first what I'm gonna share with you is this one. It's the Commodity Gold. I don't have the bottle anymore. I think I threw it. The only thing that I was able to show you guys would be this empty box 
definitely gonna be a repurchase sometime in the future i'm not gonna be like an immediate purchase for this one because i would like to experiment with other more natural perfume brands so i'm still looking in the market for a more natural perfume then we have this one it's a hair treatment i use this as a conditioner i don't know how to pronounce it nigel nigel air <laughs> But the only reason why I was able to know this particular product was because earlier this year, I had my hair straightened like a treatment. I heard that this is a Japanese brand. Correct me if I'm wrong. And usually, I don't like any hair products that has alcohol in it. But the only reason that I used this was because of that treatment. So yeah, I'm not gonna repurchase this though. Because my hair is still good. But then the regrowth, of course, you know, have been more curly or wavy. So I guess I'm gonna go back to my more vegan, cruelty-free, friendly products. I'll show you the products that I use in another video. But anyways, I think this was good though. If you want to go ahead and try this, this is good. I do wash my hair only twice a week so this is good as a conditioner but if you do wash your hair every day this i think would really weigh your hair down unless you have a really thick hair and then we have this one it's the bio true wash and loam contact lens solution i wear a contact lens since 2010 i believe and then 2010 2011 and then i have tried a lot of contact lens solution but i always go back to this one because this is the only one that i really love it doesn't dry my eyes like others and then i feel that my contact lens are really cleaner once i put them back in because i have the month ones try this brand guys if you wear contact lens and if you are in a search of a good contact lens solution you can buy it anywhere target wherever it's really good next is this one this is the 100 percent pure jasmine green tea tonic this is the how the bottle looks like and it has a spray I really love this one. I got the normal to dry. Even though I'm oilier on my T-zone, I feel when it comes to toner, I don't want to try anything that is for oily skin because I have noticed in the past when I buy a toner that is made for oily skin, it really makes my face very tight and very dry. You know, for the first five minutes, it's fine. But then later on, I produce more oil and when I apply makeup, it doesn't really look good because it has patchy, patchy areas and it's not really good. So this one is good. I'm going to try to repurchase this one sometime in the future. But I still want to try the other toners from 100% pure because i love that brand anyway if you're looking for a toner and your combination oily skin uh try this one out from 100 percent pure they're good next one is again from 100 percent pure it is their foam cleanser it's the mint white tea cleanser normal to oily i can't say anything bad against this this is good it can't remove 100 percent your makeup though so anyways for removing makeup don't rely only for this one because it won't remove all your makeup especially if you're wearing a waterproof makeup do double cleansing or have a great makeup remover first and then just follow up on this one it's good it's not stripping too much of your natural oils this is like a repurchase for me sometime in the future but i do still want to experiment on other cleansers from 100 percent pure or i'm looking into some korean brands to try later on so i'm gonna look for other cleansers but this one it's worth a try and then next is from lush 
So this is their bubble gum lip scrub. This is really, really good. It has been with me for a long time. Not because it has a lot, but because before I, I'm not really religiously scrubbing my lips. It took me a while to really finish this one. I think more than six months. There you go. Really good. If you're looking for a lip scrub, go ahead and try this one. And it's vegan. That's it guys for everything and then I only have two more items that are non-consumable that I'm just purging because it doesn't work out anymore. The first one item that I'm gonna throw away because I don't think I can donate this. It's not the best shape anymore. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna open it. It's gross. <laughs> anyway, this is the Misto, an oil mister. I got this one in Target. This is good if you like oil you use oil every day multiple times a day but since I don't really use oil anymore and that's why this doesn't work for me anymore anyways that's that and then the second one is this this is my uh, water bottle that was gifted to me I don't know where it was purchased but I love it because of these levels or markings the only reason that I'm gonna give it away now because the cap rusted and that really turned me off so i don't know why that happened i guess because i put it in the dishwasher probably i'm not supposed to do that next time i won't anymore i'm in the search of another glass bottle that has like this handle like this because it's so easy to carry wherever i'm looking for something like this anyway guys that is everything thank you so much if you have stayed until the very end i appreciate your time i hope you guys were able to see anything that you're interested in you know comment down below if you have any questions about the products that i've shared with you i'm interested to know what are your favorites for the month of may or you know the things that you have purged from your house it's always good not to hoard things right that doesn't work anymore again guys thank you so much for watching please comment and like this video and don't forget to subscribe i'll go ahead and talk to you guys later bye